So I'm standing here with one of my favorite shows. We've got Mystigan and we've got Urza. And these are very beautiful costumes. How long did it take you guys? Um, I worked on mine off and on for about six months. Mine was off and on for probably about four months. Wow, that sounds really hectic. I know what it's like to be in a co or working on a costume for that long. Um, it looks really good, guys, so congratulations. Um, so what about your costume was the hardest? For me, it was getting the breastplate. Blah, blah, blah. The breastplate fitted. Um, it was my first time working with Warbla. I lit it on fire a couple times, um, but I was all overall fairly satisfied with the result. As to be expected with Warbla, that's kind of how it works sometimes. I've lit a couple things on fire myself. Yeah. <laughs> what about you, Missigan? For me, the hardest part of the costume was the strap that holds up all of the different staves because it was really hard to come up with the design. They would hold all four of them simultaneously while not still killing me and it's still a pain in the butt on my shoulder. <laughs> yeah, straps and stuff like that, I, I know all classes are the worst thing to do with cosplay. It's always been a problem. Um, so what inspired you guys to do these costumes? I've always loved Erza. Um, she's amazing, she's strong, independent, beautiful. I mean, she's wonderful. If there was someone I could be, it'd be her, and this is about as close as it's gonna get. <laughs> yeah, she's, she's pretty much bad. What about you? Uh, I picked Mist again because we all kind of decided after Erza and we have a Natsu in our group and a Lucy and we all kind of decided that we wanted to do a big fairy tale group and I didn't really want to be Grey so I decided to pick the next character so instead of being a main character I decided to choose Mistigan. Well, that sounds good guys. Uh, I mean, as I told you before, Mistigan's probably one of my favorites. Uh, you guys look awesome. Thank you guys. Yeah.